Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today I figured I would do a night routine for y'all. So I just showered and I'm in my pajamas and I'm gonna braid my hair because that's what I do before bed. I love braiding my hair before bed because that's just what I do because then in the morning it's like really like cramped or whatever. So I love doing that. So I just brushed out my hair. <laughs> I'm going to just braid it. Um, I don't know. And I'm not really good at braiding my hair, so it probably won't turn out like super good. But like I don't really care because in the morning it's always like crimped and stuff like that. So it doesn't really bother me. Um, yeah. I'm trying to keep on track of making videos um, for YouTube because I haven't been posting quite a bit and I'm just kind of trying to keep on track and yeah so um, so I have like maybe two more videos to upload maybe I don't know I don't know if they're uploaded yet. I kind of, I uploaded them, but I don't know if they're still uploading or what. But yeah, as you can see, there's like pieces that kind of just fell out of my hair, but you know. <clears throat> it doesn't really bother me. So yeah, my hair is getting so much longer and I love it because I've always wanted longer hair. And it's, I mean, like, it's best to have my hair long during the uh, winter time rather than the summertime because you get, like, super, super hot during the summer time. And so I just think the winter time is best. <laughs> so, yeah. See, I missed a few hairs in the back, so... I'll show you better here in a sec. Mm, I missed a lot of hair in the back. Can you see that at all? Anyways, I missed so much hair, but that's okay, because at least some of it will be crimped, and then I can just curl the rest of it. So I got a new toothbrush, and um, it's a really cool toothbrush. Um, it's more like of a, it's Star Wars, so, um, yeah, but I don't really care for Star Wars, but I've always wanted the electric toothbrush, and this is all they had, so I had to get Star Wars. I'm, I'm really not sure how to open this. Oh, I think I just broke it. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I really just can't get this open. Oh, here we go. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know if there's batteries already in it, whoops, okay, I don't know if there's batteries already in it, <gasps> there is already batteries in it, that's perfect, so now I'm just going to brush my teeth, and this is what the toothbrush looks like, I think it's pretty cool, I don't know, I do. So there's already batteries in it, and so that's like perfect. And then I have this um, toothpaste that's AIM, and it's minty. And I just put some toothpaste on there. And, um, yeah, and we brush.
It's just so weird. You guys like watch me brush my teeth. Clean as can be. So then what I do is I take this five minute stuff and I do this. So um, my Google is in my room. So I have to go to my room real quick. Um, so yeah, um, I'm gonna go to my room. It smells really good out there. I'm gonna go to my room because that's where my Google is. And then I'm gonna show y'all what I do after I am done with, like, when I'm, like, done getting ready for bed. So, yeah. So, first things first is I have this um, five minute, um, like, tooth whitening gel. And you can actually find this at Dollar Tree. I found this at my Dollar Tree here, and I instantly wanted it so bad. I was so excited. Um, yeah. And so, and then I have this, and you just put it on the side of it. And then you put it in your mouth, and you set a timer for five minutes. So, um, I'm just going to show you what I do and how I do this. So, you're supposed to brush your teeth first, like, with your normal, um, toothbrush stuff, like, your toothbrush and toothpaste. Then you do this. And it will give you instructions, too, but I just, um, do this, and I just squeeze it. I put it onto the sides, like that. I don't put a lot, but, yeah. So, when it comes out, sorry, y'all probably can't see it. When it comes out, it's this clear color. You put it on both sides, so there's two sides. And then, you set a timer for five minutes. And then you put it in your mouth. And then when five minutes is up, you take it out. And you go and rinse your mouth off. So I will, once the five minutes is up, I'll rush to the bathroom and go and do that. So, yeah. Hey Google. Set a timer for five minutes. Third timer for five minutes. Starting now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 
This <laughs> is Google couldn't hear me. And then I just rinsed my mouth out. Sorry guys that it took forever and that it was boring. <laughs> my mouth out like this y'all and then uh, I'm done now guys now I have to go shut off my alarm because that's really the most annoying thing hey Google pause so I shut off Google and I really tell it to pause then I come over here, and it's 
I go ahead and I um, check on my baby girl because um, she's been sick. She's not um, sleeping like yet for bed. She did not take a nap either. She's just been sitting here and um, stuff waiting for mommy to get done because she always does that. And she always waits for mommy, huh? You always wait for mommy. So, if y'all see something wrong with her eye, it's because she does have a bandage on her eye. Her little sister whacked her in the face and uh, scraped, scraped her, like, arm. So, we've been dealing with that. Um, her sister just turned, like, four months old, so... <laughs> just doing a lot of naughty things. Um... But her sister scraped her and scratched her eye, like the inside of her eye, really bad. So the doctor said she has to wear this eye patch thing. But yeah, he said he has. Um, she has to wear this for now, and then we're gonna end up getting like a probably like a little eye patch thing. For now, he said just put a like a bandage over, like a little band aid or something. So that's what I've been doing. Um, we had to switch it out ever so often, but poor baby girl. I want to go see if her sister's awake, because she's probably awake. I just want her to stay away from her sister. Oh, there she is. She is awake. You're supposed to be going to bed, Missy. So, Anna stays awake with me, and then when I go to bed, she goes to bed, but little miss... Little Miss Natalie over here is supposed to be in bed. What happened? Why aren't we in bed? So, I think she just woke up because she kind of like does that in the middle of the night. Or sometimes, sometimes she'll wake up and just like stay there and just stay awake. So most of the time it's because she had like a bad dream or something. So I just kind of, you know, let it happen. But she's wide awake, huh? And yeah, why are you wide awake? No, you're not gonna bite mommy. Come on, sit up. So she's trying to find her sister so she can be mean to her, but that's not gonna happen. So basically, what I do is I spend time with my little girls um, after a while. I just basically kind of spend time with them for a little bit. And then we get ready for bed. Well, I get little Missy ready for bed first because she goes to bed. Her other sister, Everly, is actually sleeping now. So we have to be kind of quiet. But, um, yeah, she's sleeping over there. This one was supposed to be sleeping. Huh. She is trying to climb. But yeah, she was supposed to be sleeping. Um, but apparently she decided she was going to wake up. She's getting tired. Somebody's getting tired. Oh, she's getting tired. She wouldn't even show her face anymore. Here you go. Show your face. She's getting tired. She's ready to sleep. <laughs> Look at her getting all sleepy. Okay, well, I kind of just have her here. And I think uh, she fell asleep. I'm going to lay her on my bed for a little bit until I can put her into the crib. I'm just going to kind of lay her on my bed. Um, I just kind of... I'm going to move everything and just lay her on my bed until that. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I just don't want her to wake up, but I'm going to lay her on my bed. And, yeah. She's going to go to sleep, and so I'm going to be very quiet. Miss Anna is over here. <clears throat> Miss Anna, was, she was like, when um her sister hit her and scraped her up and... All that she was like can I hit her back and I was like no you cannot you're older you have to be more nice <clears throat> I 
for all you that, guys that don't know that, um, Anna is, um, she's going to be turning three soon, so she is two and a half, she will be three on Christmas, so yay, we don't have that much longer, but yeah, she'll be three, and yeah, <laughs> so say hi, she is a little bit shy, she is really, like, scared now because of this patch thing on her eye and knowing that she'll have to wear it, like, the rest of her life. Um, it's pretty scary because she's starting preschool next year in 2021. <laughs> she's starting preschool and she's, like, just really scared because, um... None, she doesn't think any of the other kids are going to have eye patches, which probably won't, but it's really scary because she's going to be starting, you know, a new school or starting school for the first time. She's never actually been to school. So, yeah, at this time, I kind of just let her go and play. So, right now, um, I'm going to let her play with her dollies. Which are over here. So, um, we have the dolly section over here. Um, oh my gosh, we're gonna move the doll section. It's all over by, like, right by the crib. Like, the bassinet. Where, um, right by the bassinet where, um, Ed sleeps. And I just kind of want to, here, you could sit up, baby. Okay, so she has the... Can I show them your dollies? Yeah? Okay. So, um, these are her dollies, <laughs> aka mine that she stole. Um, so, here's her first doll. Um, this one's a real American girl doll. I just don't know her name. I pulled her hair back into a little bun. I don't know her name. Um, so I just came up with a name for her. Her name's Mariah because that's just the name I came up with her because she doesn't have, like, a real, you know, name. Because, well, she does, but I just don't know it. And she has this wheelchair that I bought for her, obviously. Uh, she has this wheelchair. And the reason she has to wear, be in a wheelchair is because, um, lately she has, like, um... She just has problems with her legs ever so often. And so they decided it would be best for a wheelchair for her. So then here is an LOL doll surprise, which I got. I got a lot of this stuff for um, Anna. I got the LOL surprise for Anna mostly. But yeah. So I have this LOL surprise. And um, so Anna decided this was going to be... Um, her LOL surprise. So, this is hers. So, since she's bored a lot, doesn't have anything to do, we kind of just stick it right there and she could just play with it if she wants. Um, then she got these headphones today for her dollies. She can choose which one she wants um, to put them on. Today, she decided she wanted to put it on this one. So, I t and then I took them off and put them on her other doll so that's why they were on her other doll but I just took them off now and they are kitty cat headphones and so when she's doing her schoolwork, her homeschool because she is through zoom <laughs> okay um yeah she also has this other one I made a homemade outfit for it um doesn't look too good, but this is supposed to be like a little shirt. Whoop. Whoa. This is a shirt right here. And then this down here is a skirt, obviously. But, yeah. Um, so this is her dolly section. Plus she has this doll, too, that she likes. She has so many dolls. <laughs> so, yeah, I just kind of... Um, do that, and I'm going to let her play. Do you want to push your dolly in the wheelchair? Come on, push your dolly. <laughs> Are you not wanting to push dolly? Oh, she's trying. Oh. Okay, guys, so here she 
Oh, you probably cannot see her. Um, here she is. This is the back of her, the back of her dolly. She's, I'm helping her a little bit, but yeah. Oop, where can I get a better angle? This is so hard. Um, so, this is so hard because I want to get her in it. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is going to be, like, oddly hard. I'm going to, like, switch, switch positions because I really want to, like, get both of them in it. Whoop! I want to get both of them in it. Um, see how cute it is. Sorry. I, I just want to get both of them in it. Sorry. For now. See how cute it is. Whoop. Here we go. Okay, but we're going to move it this way for a sec. I'm hoping. Okay. There you go. There you go. Now you can push all you want. <laughs> so, I'm going to show you all now. Here she is trying to push the wheelchair, of course. Uh oh. Did you fall? Why are you taking your hands off? Oh, okay. Do you not want to play with Dolly? Okay. Um, so, today she's been having a rough day because she, um, I don't know, because of her eye patch and all that. So, she's been having quite of a rough day. <coughs> Um, I, I don't know, she's just been off today. Doesn't want to play with dollies. Okay, so, um, I don't know what time it is. Oh, 9.36. Um, 9.36. I want to, since she's kind of, like, been off, I think she's getting a little sick. And with her eye, maybe, she's just not really having it. She feels a little warm right now, so I'm just going to, like, keep checking on her in the middle of the night. It's starting to feel, like, warm. I'm really just going to keep checking on her and see how she goes on through the night. I'm going to get her um, ready for bed. She's pretty much ready. She's just wearing a onesie, which I don't mind her wearing. I'm probably just going to take the onesie off, though, and she has an underneath shirt, and I'm probably just going to leave the underneath shirt on her. I don't know. I'm going to see how it goes, um, but I'm going to get her ready for bed because she definitely needs to go to bed. Her sisters are in bed, and normally she goes to bed the time I go to bed, um, but um, I don't know. I'm probably going to go to bed soon anyways. But, um, I just want to get my baby girl better, back to normal, feeling better, so, yeah, um, yeah, I uh, just really hope that she's not getting, like, the flu, because she feels, like, warm, warm, and... I hope that she's not going to, like, end up getting sick and, like, throwing up in the middle of the night because I have to go to school and I won't, I'm not going to skip school. So, um, yeah, I just really hope that she feels better tomorrow. But she does feel, like, super, super warm and I feel bad for you, baby. Marie feels so bad for you. Mm -hmm. And she doesn't even want to play with her dollies. Are you hungry? Oh, your mandate's coming off of your wrist. I guess we can take that off now of your wrist because we're not, you know, don't need it. There's no scratch anymore. No blood. 
Mm. I really hope you feel better, babies. Okay, come here. We're gonna go get changed. Okay, y'all. So, you're gonna come along on the journey to get changed. We'll get her changed. I um, am going to clean up my floor here in a second. So, that way we could just, I don't know. I don't know, do something. I am going to take off her onesie. So, nope, oh, y'all probably gonna have to be like that for a sec. I'm just gonna take off her onesie. So, that way, sorry, these buttons aren't coming off, kid. Okay. So, then that way she can. I'm gonna take off her onesie so that way she can be really comfortable. Plus, if she does throw up, then it's so much easier for me to just kind of like take off her shirt because this onesie is pretty tight and so it's harder to get off. So, um, yeah, it's harder to get off. So, if she got sick or something, it would just be super hard to get off and she would have to be like worrying about me. So, yeah. What? So, yeah. Um, I'm going to give her one kissy and then I'm going to put her to bed. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. If I just let her lay there, she'll just go to bed by herself. She's pretty good about that. So, good night, baby. Mommy loves you. Love you. Hope you feel better. So, in the morning, um, if she's not feeling any better, I'm going to give her some kids Tylenol, and I'm going to go to the store and get her some Pedialyte, and she absolutely hates Pedialyte, but when you're sick, you just kind of have to go with the flow. You have to go with what you're going to, you know, do. So, when you're sick, it's just... Uh, a go with the flow thing. I'm going to clean my room up here in a little bit. I can, I mean, it's not super messy, so I can do it in the morning if I needed. But, you know, when you're sick, it's just like a go with the flow. Like, you have to t drink Pedialyte and take medicine. So, I'm going to let her do that. Um, thank you so much for watching my night routine. I hope you enjoyed. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss my any of my videos. Remember, you are who you are and you stay who you are because you are the best person ever and you are you. Don't let anybody change you because you are awesome and you rule. But, um, yeah, I'm going to end this video because I'm going to go get a drink of water and then get ready for bed. So, bye. Love y'all.